Planet Dolan. Home is where the heart is, as the saying goes, but it can also be the place for a lot of insane other things. How far can you push the limits of house design? And would the novelty of some of these wear off quickly? Here's the 15 craziest houses ever. I'm Pringle the One, and today I'll be your narrator. Number 15. If you ever wanted to join the 4 meter high club, well, Oregon's Bruce Campbell has brought a piece of the skies to the ground by converting a Boeing 727 into a house. Well, since he loves the plane so much, he's trying to adapt his living to the space. Rather than make it like a traditional home, he's even put in transparent flooring so you can see all the inner workings. Number 14. Piano House in Huai Nine, China is a big building shaped like an open grand piano and a glass violin that acts as the entrance. It was a result of a project by students from Hefei University of Technology. Its purpose is to celebrate the city's advancement, but most visitors are more interested in it as a romantic hotspot and it's often booked out for weddings. Number 13. Richard Bofill is one of the most talented architects alive, so it's no real surprise that he's made himself an incredible home. He's the brains behind the W Hotel on Barcelona seafront and the Christian Dior headquarters in Paris, as well as a housing project in Paris that was used as a set in The Hunger Games. But for his home, he took an existing concrete factory and started restoring it. It's surprisingly green since he's allowed many plants to grow over and around the structures. Number 12. Upside down houses are a surprisingly common thing. It's not like you find one on every street corner, but there are plenty of people around the world who've decided to turn things on their head. Polish architects Irik Glowacki and Marek Rosanski built the reverse house in Austria that even has foundations and part of the basement that look like they've been pulled right out of the ground. It looks pretty neat. Number 11. You know when you had a long day or a big night out and you wish you could just snap your fingers and be at home? Well, although we're way off teleportation, what about if your house could travel to you? A team in Cambridge, UK built a walking living space based on the idea of an old caravan. However, it only moves at 60 meters an hour, so maybe just call a cab. Number 10. Austrian architect Hundert Wasser has created many iconic buildings, such as the tiled power station in Vienna. But some lucky Viennese can live in one of his buildings, called the Hundert Wasser House. In fact, he created it for free just because he didn't trust the government and thought they would put up something ugly. There are 53 apartments inside and it's a wacky mix of lumpy floors, angled pillars and a grass roof. Number 9. Grayson Perry is one of the UK's leading artists, famous for making weavings and pottery that tell stories of normal people. In 2015, he created a home in Essex called Julie's House that was a homage to the lives of the women in the area. It looks like a gingerbread house designed by Salvador Dali and if that sounds like your sort of thing, then you can actually rent it out for the weekend. Number 8. Sculptor Robert Bruno spent half of a lifetime creating an alien looking structure that juts out of the landscape like a rusted machine. He began in 1974 and was still welding by the time he died in 2008. It's almost entirely the work of his own hands and he only made it into home because he was spending so much time creating the thing. He just built it because he likes creating sculptures. Number 7. Art Beale bought this property called Nitwit Ridge in 1928 and set about improving it just using a few simple tools and whatever waste material he could find around. If you walk around it, you can see car parts, washing machine fixtures, beer cans, and plenty of other junk turned into a unique home. It also features a double toilet so the conversation could keep flowing no matter what. You could take a dump and talk about the dump around the area. Number 6. If you visit the Georgian capital, Tbilisi, you will notice a huge glass building atop of one of the hills looking down on the city. You can get a closer look from the botanical garden and it appears to be some sort of research center with its many glass sections and steel spheres. But it's actually home to one of the richest men in the world, Bidzina Ivanishvili, worth around 5 billion dollars. It's filled with art and has a tall glass viewing tower. The steel ball is actually a private cafe that hangs over one of the pools. Number 5. At first glance, this just looks like your normal, incredibly expensive luxury house, but this oceanfront home on Vancouver Island, Canada has an amazing unique feature. The house has its own river run through it. They suck up water from the ocean and send it down an artificial channel. It's not just for the wow factor either, it's actually a very efficient way to regulate the heat of the building. It went on the market for just 13 million dollars, so start saving those pennies. Number 4. Most of us know that our neighbors are tacky and tasteless people but we only get to see that demonstrated when they go crazy on Christmas decorations. But anyone across from this family in Mexico has proof every morning. The whole house has been painted with the Louis Vuitton monogram. 
All they need now to get one of these cars, use these bin bags, get you some fresh sneakers, and get it popping. Cause you're part of the Louis Vuitton monogram logo house. Number three. Casa do Penido, or Stone House, as it's known for obvious reasons, sits on a hillside in northern Portugal. It was built in 1972 and was perfectly integrated with the four boulders that form the walls, foundation, and ceiling. It's even got a swimming pool. Number two. Vila Akbar is sadly not named after everyone's favorite Star Wars admiral, but he surely would order immediate retreat if he ever saw this monument to bad taste. Locals call it the ugliest house in Kuwait, and it's hard to argue with them as it's coated in random Roman busts and paintings, as well as a few Mozarts thrown in for good measure. Number one. This home in Germany demonstrates some of the high quality engineering that the country is famous for. It's so energy efficient that it became the first ever home to generate more power than it used. It has a solar panel set up that moves with the sun, a rainwater collection system, and it even processes all human waste into dry, odorless solids. This video was made possible by our fans over on Patreon. Thanks for your support, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Peace.